Good morning, everyone. I hope that everyone had a great week. I hope that you have a great last week um, with school next week. So I brought a bag this morning with me, and I have some items in the bag. The first item that I have, can anyone tell me what this is? You're right, it's a hammer. What do we use a hammer for? Yes, to pound nails down. All right, my next thing I have. Can anyone tell me what this is? You're right, it's a battery. What about this? Yes, a flashlight. And what do we use a flashlight for? To see when it's dark outside, right? Or even in your bedroom or your house. What is this? Yes, a cell phone. And what do we use a cell phone for? Calling or texting? You got it. What do I have here? You're right, a camera. And what do we use a camera for? Yes, to take pictures. And the last item that I have in my bag is this. Can anyone tell me what this is? You're right. It's a Bible. So all of these things have something in common. What is a Bible, a camera, a cell phone, a flashlight, a battery, and a hammer all have in common? They have power. You use your power to pound down the nails. The batteries help the power in flashlights. Our cell phone has power so we can use it. You have to have a power in your camera to be able to use it. And the Bible has all kinds of power. God has power and he gave each one of you your own powers. What are some of your powers that you have? Those are some pretty amazing powers you have. But you know what? He also gave us the power in the form of the Holy Spirit. He gives us the Holy Spirit to us to give us the power, the courage, excitement, and strength to tell people about him and how he loves us in our own way in words. So my challenge for you this week is to work on spreading the Holy Spirit to others. This could be through coloring pictures and mailing it to someone, praying for others, or doing something around your house to help out your mom or dad. Or ask your parents if you could help out our own community by donating to the food pantry. These are all ways that you can spread the Holy Spirit. Let's close in prayer. Dear God, thank you for giving each of us our own power and the Holy Spirit to spread to others. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So just a reminder that I'm going to be starting Zoom sometime in June. This is a time for us to check in with one another and a time for us to chat. We will also be doing a small activity. I hope that you have a great week and I'm looking forward to talking to you again next week.